You know what I, I find a, a lot of these YouTubers funny, right? Because uh, they'll make videos. They're saying Redbox could squeeze to $500 a share. Okay, It's theor theoretically possible because the float is so small. What is it, 2 million shares? The interest rate is so high. I mean, it's crazy. 800, 900% cost to borrow. I mean, this thing is is got squeeze written all over it. But then, like, if I want to buy in now, I was going to buy in at 8. But Mr. Chad Clifford told me not to do it. Thanks, Chad. You are aces, brother. Uh, he's the joker. But anyway, uh, I was thinking about originally buying in at 8. Missed that, missed that opportunity. Listen, this thing could, could uh, this thing could tumble. This could be like another clove. I don't want to get everybody's hopes up, but I'm just saying that there is a possibility. Theoretically, this thing could shoot up to over a hundred, two hundred, three hundred, four hundred, five hundred dollars a share. I mean, to me, it's just more money I would use to buy AMC and GameStop. You know what I mean? If I could make a nice little swing trade, you know, something where I could get in there quick. You know, just. Uh, you know, get 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 some nice profits, throw it all into AMC, all into GameStop. That would be a wonderful thing. Nothing in life is guaranteed. None of us have a crystal ball. That's why I always say to use spare change. Don't use your big money. You know, just if you got a couple of extra bucks sitting around that you don't need, that you don't mind losing, that you can risk, go for it. That's 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 the way I see it. But yeah, theoretically, this thing could go as high as five hundred dollars a share. Sure, with this small float. If everybody starts buying away, <laughs> this thing, this thing could uh, go on fire. Come on, baby, light my fire, red box. You know it's going to go higher. Come on, baby, light my fire. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's very possible that you might see some tremendous heights. I mean, this is going to be amateur night at the Apollo compared to AMC and GameStop. But it might be worth throwing a couple of fazools in there. You know what I mean? I'm not a financial advisor. I don't give financial advice. I'm an entertainer.